Hey guys, it's Randomly Marnay. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. Today I'm going to tackle this very scary linen closet. It is so disorganized. We purchased this home about a year and a half ago and I had to figure out like what to do with all these blankets and stuff. So I have a laundry basket and two of those gray totes over there. I'm going to see if I can fit them in this closet um, and use them for organization. This is going to be so cheap, so easy, so free. I'm using what's in my closet. You will love it. Hang around. You won't be spending a dime. I'll show you how to get it done. I've got my cleaning products over here ready to go. And again, of course, some more bath towels that heck I don't know what to do with. But let's go ahead and get everything out of this crazy closet. I love to save and reuse plastics and glass. How about you guys? Do you save anything like for future reference? Sometimes I'll save it and I don't even know what the heck I'm gonna use it for. But you know, I just try to like help out the environment and, and reuse some things. So what about you guys? Leave it in the comments below. What do you always save? Just in case you're wondering what the heck is on my head, today I washed my hair. And if you didn't know, drying your hair with a t-shirt is so much healthier for your hair than a towel. All right, guys, so here we go. A few months prior to shooting this video, I began to save all of my comforter bags. Um, I had no idea what I would use them for. It just felt so wasteful to throw them out because they have like these nice strong zippers and this really tough plastic. And so I would just shove them in my linen closet and sure enough, they're coming in handy. And yes, that, that is my dog walking around. We have hardwood floors and he's kind of tipping around. I have two dogs, by the way. Um, but you know, they came in super handy. So what I I did was I started to organize the closet by putting things in groupings so I grabbed all of my throw pillows and I put them in a comforter bag all of my sheets I put together all of my curtains I put together all of my towels I put together this came in so handy guys I love Dollar Tree I love Walmart and I love to save money but listen, there's nothing better than free. So start to save those comforter bags, just stick them somewhere because they're gonna come in handy and they make for great storage.
so these vacuum seal bags i picked up at dollar tree if you guys don't know dollar tree has like those you know um seal tight vacuum bags where it shrinks all of your stuff so you can stack like a ton of things in a closet only one of the bags <laughs> worked i don't know why um hey there's my dog there's creed i also have a dog named maxwell they're brothers from the same litter <laughs> he came to say hi but it didn't work so i'm vacuuming this one and it just won't stay sealed um i vacuumed the other one and it did stay sealed so i don't know maybe it was just a fluke you know maybe i should have gotten a better brand from another store i don't really know but i just wanted to you know let you guys see how these bags work and yeah it <laughs> it was a total fail i ended up taking them out and putting in, putting them in a comforter bag You see me just checking around here looking for space to make sure I can fit every single sheet that I have in this bag and nope I was not folding today you saw me shove that sheet down in there listen my husband and I we both do laundry equally um, and we both fold equally but once we leave that laundry room listen if it's not folded down there it's not getting folded upstairs okay okay i fibbed a little bit <laughs> you see me doing some faux folding right here i just wanted to get them nice and neat so i can put them in the comforter bag since the bag is clear you know i can look right into it and see what's in there so i figured why you know why not fold them up make them nice and neat put them together by color and style um, that way i know what i have And it's cleaning time I'm gonna go ahead and wipe these shelves down including the side walls I picked up this spick and span from Walmart I think it was like two bucks or 250 or something like that um, but it smells so so good so you know hey why not clean the shelves and make it smell fresh in there as well we're gonna go ahead and wipe everything down and then put everything back nice and neat So you'll see here that I did decide to use those gray totes. I've had these totes forever. Um, I had them in my 
formal apartment in Miami. And I want to say that I got them from Dee Dee's discount and they were like five bucks each. They do fit in the closet side by side, but I can't put them in the closet simultaneously side by side. So I filled one of the totes, put it in the closet, and then I put the other tote in the closet, folded, and then expanded it once it was in the closet. And then I just stuffed all the comforters and blankets, um, the actually just comforters down in there. These are comforters that I only use when guests come, which is super, super rare, typically around the holidays. So I don't need to get to them often. Um, so let me know, you know, what do you guys use or reuse around the house? And think about what you can use around your house. Keep in mind, I did not spend a dime on redoing this closet. I'm sure you've got some stuff around there that you can use. So you'll see I'm just testing, you know, kind of to see what fits where and rearranging um, some of these comforter bags. You know, some of them are really, really um, high or thick and others are kind of slim. So I'm just seeing what can fit where. These gray baskets I had in my office on the floor with nothing in it. I bought them from five below and I thought I would use them in my office, but I ended up having more storage than I realized. So I, they were just extra. So again, guys, you know, throw it in the comments below. Let me know what's around your house and what you can reuse to help you organize as well. So there she is guys, my completely free linen closet makeover. You see that I did utilize those comforter bags at the very, very top. I've got my air mattresses because we have family and they come in town for the holidays. And then I've got my curtains and in that basket, I've got my uh, air mattress um, pump. And right below that, I've got washcloths and floor mats. And below that, I've got bath towels and sheets. Below that, I have all of my throw pillows, and at the very, very bottom in those two gray totes, I have my blankets. Thank you so much, guys. Think about what you have around your home. I'm sure you can do this too. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, share, all that good stuff. Bye.